I just want to talk a little bit about something significant. I hear this word I a lot. I will do this. I will do that. People walk around and they say, I, I. They rise up with the sun and they lay down when the sun sets and they say, I. But the greatest victories in this world, the things that have been enveloped in nations that have surrounded people, that have overwhelmed armies, that have conquered kingdoms, do not begin with I. They begin with him. When it comes to evangelism, it's not about me. It's not about you. It's not about the many. It's about him. And when he's involved with anything, the I becomes irrelevant because God is in charge. God is the one who gives the victories. The battle is the Lord's. God is the one who makes us his instruments for his glory. God is the one who, through providence, who opens up doors. God is the one who, through the word, when it goes into people's hearts, they are impacted. When we say I, we take the emphasis off of God, off of the gospel, and we put it upon ourselves. Evangelism is not about I. The groups we do will be directed by Jesus through the word of God. He owns it. As he owns each one of us who are redeemed by his blood, he owns the events, the activities, the, the interactions, the group dynamic, the work. All of this is centered around Jesus. The attitude is not about I, but about being a servant, letting him work in us as our master, Lord, King, and Savior. So when we begin this group, I'm going to be beginning it soon with some wonderful people. But it's not about us. It's about him. It's not about what I can do. When Jesus Christ, we, through Jesus Christ, we will have him work in us to accomplish his good pleasure. It's about his glory, his purpose, and his will, and he is able. There is nothing about us when it comes to evangelism. We're just his vessels, or his power, his work, his glory, through the word of God working in us. I'm grateful to be working with some fantastic people. I'm excited to get these evangelism events done. They're going to be beginning soon, but they're going to be done through Jesus, through his word working in us. It's about him. It's about the cross. Just wanted to put that out there. Evangelism, before anything else begins, the right attitude must be the component. For Bible studies, for doing outreach work, for methods, for teaching, whatever it is, it is Jesus working in us. Our attitude, our lives, our thoughts, our behaviors are all centered around that. Not I, but him. Thanks for watching. God bless.